Here it is folks, the GE air conditioner model AJC S10 AC AM1. It was manufactured in 2002. So at the time of this recording it is now 14 years old. Here are the specs on it. It's 9900 BTU, 115 volts, and you can read the rest here. In the garage, yes. Some stuff has been cleared away. And here we have it. I had tested this unit once when I moved in, and if I remember correctly it worked, otherwise I probably would have gotten rid of it. Uh, I think I have the front for it also, let me see. Here it is, the cover for it. I'll see if maybe it pops back on. No reason to really keep it off. We'll run it without the cover for now. Um, it's plugged in and ready to go. I have no idea which is cooling and which is just fan. Might be a circuit breaker. Continuous cycle. Seems stuck. Okay. Let's try left. That's fan. I think that's high. Nope, that was low. This is high. So much air that moves. Quite powerful. I like it. Damn. This would be awesome if it works. Okay, well, I guess we're ready to go. So I gather this direction is going to be low cool. Nice! <laughs> It started, that was the first time in almost 10 years that this has been started up. It sounds like it's probably pushing refrigerant around. This looks like it was a sleeved unit. Um, back here, I guess it's still in the sleeve because this is the back of it. Or I'm not really sure. They left it. We put it in the sleeve, maybe. I think maybe the sleeve was separate and we found this fit in it. I, I just don't remember. It's been too long. Oh, it's getting cold. Coils are pretty dirty. Oh, it's getting cold, all right. Let's go to high. Oh, damn. That's real nice. Well, like I said, I knew I kept it for something. So I'm going to let that run for a bit. Now, I know a lot of you are asking, well, what about this unit? Well, it's 240 volts, so I don't have that kind. That's the plug. So that ain't a standard plug. So it's definitely 240. What is it? Got an electronic control panel. I know I don't like that. It's also a GE down in the corner there. And that's all you're going to get out of me on it right now because I don't know if it works or what the deal is. But I'll let this run for a while and we'll see how it's doing. There's two separate fan motors. I turn the fan between speeds and the fan in back is still running, but there's no airflow. You would hear it. And if I just flip it, now you can hear the airflow. This has got two separate fan motors. Serious fucking unit. I like it. Nice. It is getting cold. All right. Let's see what we got. First of all, the wall. Yeah, it's almost 90 degrees. Sixties. This again hasn't run in 10 years, so it really should, you know, have a good run for a while. But it's certainly cool. I mean, it's almost 20 degrees spread, so... As you can see, point up. Yeah, <laughs> real hot. Real hot one today. Alright, it's off now because the 
compressor actually shut off because it overheated because there is no airflow out the back because it's just dumping right to the wall. So I'm going to let this cool down for a bit and um, then we'll uh, give it a shot, see if it'll restart. And then at least I know it works. All right, let's get this a shot again. I don't know if it's been long enough. Wait for the car to go by before I do that. Let's try it now. If not, I'm going to shut it immediately. Oh yeah. No problem. Ooh. No, it didn't like that kind. All right, well, I'll let it cool a little more. All right, anyways, let this cool for a little more. We'll try it again. It runs. It's just very unhappy about not being able to exhaust its hot air -ness. And Oh, yeah, it's fucking steaming back here, really. It's hot, and this is nice and cool here, so. Anyway, it does work, and it's here, and maybe this will be the garage AC one day. We'll see. Man can always dream. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure you hit like, make sure you hit subscribe, and take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.